All right, I love your new hat, Littner. Talk Rockin to you, buddy. It. Rookie watch. Got to keep it going. How'd you go today? It was awesome, dude. Uh, I love the track. It really reminded me of Glen Helen. Love that track. And, uh, you know, this weekend I just came in and I wanted to really get um, some good starts and be consistent. And that did happen. The first moto, I ended up with a fifth place start. That's the best start I've had all year. So I'm super pumped. And then just uh, after the one little step up there, one of the kids just launched it and just kind of came in on me and teep on me. But it's all right. Uh, it's racing right everyone makes mistakes and uh, came back from 33rd to 19th so I had a good push there and then second moto came along had another good start 12th place and uh, ended up 16th so went 19 16th for 20th overall definitely can't complain so uh, just gonna go into Walton doing the youth class on amateur week and then uh, go on pro day and hopefully see some big results so uh, yeah just thanks to everyone and thanks to Galdi for always doing this and guaranteed MX thanks guys all right, we got to keep the rookie watch going. Weston Rosina, buddy, tell me how your day went because I was really impressed with your second moto. I thought you, you rode really good. Yeah, you know, day started off decently in, uh, in practice and stuff, and uh, then ended up uh, in the first corner pileup with a bunch of other riders. I got that in my Instagram video. <laughs> oh, yeah, it was violent and uh, ended up, you know, at the, pretty much at the bottom of that one. And then I just kept on, I got up off Down? that and uh, kind of pushed my way through. And I uh, got up and uh Is he making fun in behind you? Yeah, again? I got I got a I got a digs to be in a meat slice? Yeah. Why are you ruining the videos? Yeah, you're killing it. We're here. trying to promote your product and stuff. Come on. Yeah, and then I just uh I got back up and I got charging again and then ended up crashing again on that like two laps later. And uh <clears throat> just kept on charging and up and then on the last two laps I went from like thirtieth to twenty third, which wasn't too too bad, but uh you know, not too happy about the first moto. Second moto got off to a decent start and then hit a kicker and went off the track right off the start. And uh, kept on charging and uh, ended up getting bulked, which, you know, it's just pretty good. I'm pretty happy with it. I kept on charging the whole moto and uh, I'm happy that I was able to do that. Uh, just, you know, can't wait for Walton. And, and uh, you know, well, I think Walt next week is going to be really fun and I'm going to get my best finish there. Pull your pants up, Dylan. <laughs> All right, buddy, got to keep that rookie watch going. Uh, first moto, not great. Second moto, charged hard. I thought you fought really hard out there. You just tell me how it went. Uh, always fun to watch, man. You never really seem to let anything out. You always leave it on the track. I always like to watch that about you. Oh, uh, yeah, for sure. Uh, first moto wasn't exactly the best moto of my life. Um, uh, Topher ended up going down in the first corner and uh, hit him, and then I went down and was dead last. And it finally got going, but then it blew my rear brake out, so I had no rear brake. And going down the hills was just sketchy, I guess <laughs> you could say, with just front brake. And I managed to catch up to 16. And then just Moto 2 tried to shake it off as much as I could, and uh, I did all right. I got a almost got the whole shot. I was I think I was fourth or fifth, and uh, that's kind of where I ended up. I ended up six. I was catching Benoit in the last bit of the moto, but I ended up just sliding out with two laps to go, and he just got away from me. So. Uh, happy with the day. Um, just gonna carry it into Walton, I guess.